All right, Ron. So there's no <laughs> gear shift. <laughs> you just give it gas and go? Yeah, put, put your foot on the brake. All right, and then you just swipe up. Oh, hold on. Phone's in there, so it's messing up. Yeah, just swipe up. We're in gear. Oh, boy. And it's real touchy, and it turns really sharp, so kind of just drive around the park lot until we... And then that's... Just kind of like my tractor. When you take your foot off the gas, it, it like yeah. almost stops. Yeah. yeah. Let's drive around a little bit in the park lot until you get. When you take your foot off the accelerator, it's just real sharp. See, it's all tight. Ah, it yeah. It's like what do they call that the, um, on a tractor. It's more like uh, it's wow. And when you turn, it's like it's like oversteer because it's just like immediate. Yeah. It is responsive. Here we go, folks. <laughs> <sighs> I'm trying to get my stomach settled <laughs> from that ride a minute ago. Juice. That's all the juice I want to see. <laughs> wow. It doesn't, they don't have a shift either, yeah, do yeah, they? It's just, it's just continuous. It's a one speed gearbox, so it's just, that's it, one, one, one gear. You have to do is think yeah. about going yeah. to the right. You're yeah. in the next lane. Yeah. But. Can you imagine, like, later on, like, you hit a button and it's, it'll maintain lane. It'll, you know, basically do everything. So you well, I can see this thing unfolding some wings and you just tell it, <laughs> we have liftoff. <laughs> yeah, you give it gas, you take off at about a 30 foot spot. Yeah. Holy cow. Big window. If you tinted it, would you tint that too? Or? I do a light tint on the front windshield, and then, uh, of course, a darker tint on the sides. But uh, the problem is finding someone that can do it. That's that's it. You have to be a master of your craft to tint that windshield. Man. And be like able to get up in there. Yeah, and squeegee it out and have a rag down there to catch your squeegee. Yeah. Definitely don't want to get too much water anywhere in here. No, it's water electric. Water batteries don't mix. No. I keep looking for my blinker. Hey. And it automatically shuts it off. Too, so. <laughs> I've been dreading the minute you were saying, hey, come on, let's go drive my family. <laughs> No. <laughs> so, I know, I know this is kind of like a, you're used to that diesel, what do you think? I mean, coming from a diesel, you know, Florida grown. Uh, this is, you know, this, this is going to take some, somebody some getting used yeah. to, I'm sure. Yeah. But. You can see it. I think yeah. I just I'm also like my whole body is still trying to go wow it's like being on an amusement <laughs> ride I'm like thinking I want I want off this ride <laughs> I'm about to get car sick and Roger took off and he threw my equilibrium <laughs> in the back seat he's still like, a business <laughs> yeah oh my god your spirit your ghost I'm just glad you didn't eat those biscuits and gravy this morning. I would have had to stop. <laughs> There's just no way I could have. Oh, Wait, how do you go? Okay. Yeah, it takes a minute to get used to the. The uh, bolt blinkers are on the left side. Yeah. Left and, and right. Yeah, up and down. Oh. Since the weight, the 
batteries completely on the bottom of the truck. And the center gravity is so low, you can actually go around corners like a sports car. Yeah, I know. You left my soul <laughs> back there in the turnaround. It's like... <sighs> Did I pass us? Yeah, we're good. we can turn to the next light. Okay. Yeah, you yeah, know you're good. way around here. Linda Nap. <laughs> well, I think that's what gets me. When you take your foot off the gas, you go, Whoa. Yeah. Man, this guy. Is he taking up all the lights? Yes, he is. I just hit that button. Yep. That's the one thing it took me a while to get used to. It, you, know, I'm, you know what's really weird when you drive this for a while? And then you get in that other car and you're like, What am I doing? Because <laughs> you don't have to do that anymore. Did, so it, did it, was, it take you a minute to not be car sick for a second? -ish? Yeah, yeah. It, um, this thing's got when, my whole body thrown off. Yeah, especially when you're driving, not driving. Of course, it's different. Yeah, I'm ready to go two miles an hour <laughs> in this thing. <laughs> yeah, 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 let's go fast. <laughs> no, because that's fast. <laughs> I rode with Drake in his Mustang, and it's, and it's like different, hauling boogie all over the yeah. place. You know, yeah, it's it's different. This this is a soul snatcher. Yeah. Left my stomach back there at the about two miles back. <laughs> yeah, because you're not you don't hear you're not ready for it. No. It's, just, it's just like yeah, 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 and then every bit of you goes. <laughs> Your guts, your heart, your yeah. lungs, your <laughs> everything. This is crazy, man. It, it's like a the it's like the epitome of the, the sweeper, you know, because you're not expecting it at all. Not at all. In in 16 miles an hour, it's just fine. I'm like still trying to catch my breath. From. And people go, oh, I love to go fast. I love that. Okay. Yeah. This this is the soul snatcher. <laughs> I can't even imagine. How f what's the top speed on this? It's only like 115. They 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 uh, software limited, but this thing like it, it would go. F I mean, it would be it'd be too dangerous because it's so heavy. You know, you don't want to go over 120 miles and something weighs 7,000 pounds. Uh uh. I mean, it's like pulling a dump trailer over 100. It's just not smart. Man. <laughs> How do I do this? Yep. There. Yep. I can't say I'm, I've ever been more happier to <laughs> pull over and get out of something. I like it, but it's got my, I feel like I'm at an amusement park ride. It has literally got my whole body going. So you don't have to go to Bush Gardens now. You're. you're oh, yeah. I don't good. have to tell myself that. Uh, Amusement parks aren't push, good for push me. Park. Hold it. And then uh, this is off-road mode. So hit confirm. And now you're in four-wheel drive. Also, it's, and then hit extract. Confirm. Now we're going up to maximum height. So say you get stuck in mud or you want to go off-road. The whole suspension is lifting to max capacity. So... There's a basically an airbag on each wheel, so this is what I use. Say you're loading your dump trailer, and you, and you want to get all the way up and make that sucker tight, so when you drop stuff in it, it's not all teeter tottery or whatever. Yeah. And then if you're loading, say you have your other trailer with ramps, you want that sucker to be tongue high and tail low. So that's what it's doing now. It's kind of like adjusting the suspension. Up. So we're all the way up. Uh, so, I mean, some people like to go rock climbing or go over, you know, or say like you have this huge hole or uh, crevice that you have to go over and you don't want to bottom out. Extract mode. You want to jump a huge curb or go over some big chunks of concrete. <clears throat> I'm glad we're stopped. Yeah. And then uh, when you travel, like say you uh, take road trips, where 
where do you like to go when you take your road trip or do you anywhere somewhere scenic yeah I'm, like, I'm about either that or I like say hey you want to drive and I go yeah I never get a break I never get dressed it's yeah. always I mean if you say like you had a, a month off or, or a, couple, like a, a long week or two off where would you go on a road trip Maybe somewhere in Georgia where I could get in the mountains. <clears throat> Are we still on? Yeah. Kill it for a minute.